Back in the early days of flying, pilots used to always make power-off landings so that if the engine quit, they could just glide to the airport. Although that is a skill that all pilots need to have, it's more practical to make your approaches with a little power. You'll have more control of your glide path, and carrying a little power will actually decrease your risk of an engine failure. If the approach is getting too low and the aiming point is moving up on the windshield, what you need to do is raise the nose and add power. If you're coming in too low, you never want to try to stretch a glide to reach the runway with just back elevator pressure alone. You have to add power simultaneously. And you never want to try and correct for an undershoot by retracting the flaps on short final. Because when you retract the flaps, you lose some of the lift on the wing. And you might just end up settling into the ground before you ever get to the runway. At the best, it's terribly embarrassing. And at the worst, it could be quite painful. Now, if you're getting too high and the aiming point moves down the windshield, what you need to do then is lower the nose and reduce the power. And we'll discuss this more later on.